Welcome back to the 2022 Kayla Fan Awards. We're so happy to have Tasha Layton here with us. Tasha, I want to ask you first about the weekend events. And I want to say that you kind of blew us away oh, at the Songwriter you. Showcase last night. What an honor it, it, it was to just even sit next to Stephen Curtis Chapman. I mean, I think, you know, I've grown up with his voice. And when he started singing Saddle Up Your Horses, I didn't even realize that I knew every single freaking word of that song. And Absolutely. so when we started, um, I literally, you know, told my husband my cheeks are hurting from smiling because I felt like a kid in a candy store. Oh it was awesome. And Mac Powell, I mean, gosh, I grew up listening to him. And so I just felt really honored all night and grateful. Powerful performance after powerful Thank you. performance. Thank you. It was I, a special night, wasn't it? Was it? A, it, felt it really big. was. I want to ask you about one of the songs you did that night, Dear Daughter. Yes. Very personal message that I would encourage all of our listeners to kind of reach out and connect with. I want to ask you about how it felt to share that message and then deliver that performance last night. Well, you know, Scripture says that we overcome by the blood of the Lamb and the word of our testimony. And I think any time that we can share a story that helps bring faith or mm -hmm. to, to showcase the miraculous power of our God we need to and so that's really why I was so grateful to be able to share that story because it's a miraculous story and it, it really it's uh, not due to the power of a beautiful lyric or a melody it's due to the power of our God and Amen. so I hope that everyone uh, looks that song up and um, maybe you know could find the story online the full story yeah, about that song um, I'm most proud of that song probably more than any other song I've ever written yeah. so I want to ask you, too, about your new album. It's been out for over two weeks now. And, you know, nine co-writes on this album. And, you know, working with some amazing songwriters, too, collaborating with ideas. And I was curious, how do you get in the space when writing a song, especially with a collaborator? Sometimes I'm not in the space. <laughs> Let's just be honest. I am a mom of two kids under five. And my husband tours. And life can get really hard. And sometimes I don't feel like I have anything to give. And... When I walk into a session, sometimes I feel very blank or empty, and I just hold out my hands and I say, God, every song is a gift from you. Do what you will. Let it be to me according to your word, like Mary says in the New Testament. And so, um, you know, even into the sea, I didn't have any thoughts when I went into wow. the, the right that day. Wow. And I was too pregnant to even record the vocal. And so the vocal you hear on the radio is from when I was about 30 seconds after we recorded the song or, or read the, wrote the song. Yeah. And so, um, yes, to answer your question, it's all the above. Sometimes I go in and I know exactly what I want to write about. And sometimes I feel very blank and I just open my hands and say, God, it's not about me anyway. It's about you. Yeah, what do you want to say? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Amen to that. So happy to talk with you. Best of luck tonight. Thank you.